Hey, what's up YouTube? It's your boy Serge. So I just had a few of my teeth pulled, so I'm not gonna sound the greatest, and as you can see, my cheeks are a little bit round today. But, so in this gaming test, what we're gonna do is we're gonna play Battlefield 3 on the 2015 MacBook Air, and we're gonna put a laptop cooler in there. And we're gonna see if it actually helps. I'm gonna compare the FPS, and there's an awesome utility called Intel Extreme uh, Tuning Utility that'll show me a graph whether the computer gets cooled enough and whether the processor frequency gets increased or not. So let's get to it. All right, we're just gonna sit right here. I'm gonna see if the FPS increases. Holy smokes, it looks like it's increased. In my previous tests, the FPS increased by about 3 or 4 FPS, which isn't a whole lot. Uh, the first couple times I tested it, I really couldn't tell whether I was getting more FPS or not. So I got this extreme Intel tuning utility. This thing is great. So as you can see, after a little while of gameplay, you can see that the uh, graphics processor frequency drops to 600 from 650. Uh, the core frequency drops to 1.3, which is not very good, but it does drop. Um, and you don't really notice the throttling while you're playing the game on the MacBook Air. Um, and then even when you put the laptop cooler in, you don't really notice the greatest increase. But as you can see, it jumps to 1.8 just now. See how this graph is going up? See how it's going up right there? Back up to 1.8. That right there shows that it that the uh, actual cooler does work, even though we don't get the cra craziest FPS increase. Then I went ahead and I shut the game off. And as you can see, there's a huge drop. You saw how the GPU and the CPU frequency increased when I activated the cooling. Uh, so on the MacBook Air, it definitely helps out, uh, but it doesn't help out as much as I've noticed on certain laptops like the 12 inch MacBook. So there is a difference. Um, some laptops utilize laptop coolers more than others. Some don't, the laptop cooler doesn't even affect them. So it really depends on what kind of laptop you have. Um, and the fan placement, uh, like the air vents. Um, and like for instance, on a 12 inch MacBook, it makes a huge difference, a 30% increase in performance. Um, and I'm gonna be doing more tests on the 12 inch MacBook. Like I wanna see if the video editing can be as good as the 11 inch uh, MacBook Air, uh, but with cooling, because I think the 12 inch MacBook is a really capable device, but I wanna see how far I can push the limits of this device. Um, so if you guys are going to find that interesting, go ahead, click on these links uh, here. And if you haven't seen the 12 inch MacBook yet with a laptop cooler, I highly recommend you click on this video. Very useful stuff. And if this is your first time on this channel, go ahead, subscribe. Um, I keep a two way communication going with all my subscribers. Uh, I like to talk back and forth with you guys. And usually I reply pretty fast, like within a day, sometimes right away, because I always have my phone on me. So anytime you guys send me something, I'm replying. Um, but uh, that concludes this video and uh, my question to you guys is do you think uh, that um, it's worth it? Do you think getting a few extra FPS here and there is helpful? Um, in my particular case, I think for things like the 12 inch MacBook, definitely worth it. Um, but not so much for the MacBook Air. It does help a little bit and if you're going to take your gaming very seriously, like multiplayer gaming, like Battlefield 3 or Battlefield 4 for instance, maybe having that extra gigahertz and, and a few extra frames really is going to make a difference. It really depends on you guys. Um, but let me know what you think of that. And if you have any other ideas for a test I should do or a specific gaming test or anything at all, just let me know in the comment section below. And uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Bye. If you found this video helpful, please do not forget to press the like button. It really helps the channel out. Thanks.